Dr. Siever's mysterious death comes just weeks after a string of other deaths involving doctors who also practiced alternative medicine. And these cases are now raising concern about the safety of other doctors. Four in your corners, Tony Siddiqui, breaking down this recent trend of unsolved cases. All new at six. Tony? Patrick, Amy, a string of strange string of mysterious deaths surrounding doctors from Florida is doing more than just keeping in law enforcement busy. It's also raising eyebrows for some who are concerned for their loved ones who are doctors. Dr. Bruce Hedendahl, Dr. Jeff Bradstreet, and Dr. Teresa Ann Sievers, all three from Florida, all three alternative medicine specialists, all three found dead in the span of two weeks. Of the three, only Dr. Sievers has been ruled a homicide so far, but investigations are still underway in the other two deaths. Erin Elizabeth is in a relationship with a high-profile alternative medicine doctor. She tells me she can't help being concerned. But because we are in Florida, yeah, I just want to take extra precaution, so uh, makes, makes makes me a little concerned. Dr. Jeff Bradstreet was found in a North Carolina river with a gunshot wound to his chest that deputies say was self-inflicted. But the family doesn't buy that there was no foul play involved, so they've started a GoFundMe page to do a more thorough investigation. Bradstreet's practice had been raided by the FDA days before his tragic death. A medical doctor who uh, doesn't believe maybe in quite traditional treatments, that it's, it's not unusual for the, for the feds to investigate. Then there's Dr. Bruce Hedendahl of Boca Raton. He was found in his car dead on Father's Day. He hadn't been in a car accident. The car wasn't even running. Still no word yet on how he died. But the list doesn't stop there. Two more doctors have vanished since last Monday. Dr. Patrick Fitzpatrick of North Dakota and Dr. Jeffrey Whiteside from Wisconsin. Regardless of any correlation, the news is tragic and heartbreaking, especially for the family and friends who are still trying to come to grips with how they, their loved ones be, are being gone. I reached out to the Lee County Sheriff's Office who declined to comment on the ongoing investigation of Dr. Sievers. However, if you do have any information that could help police, urge to call Crime Stoppers at 1-800-780-TIPS. In the studio, Tony Sudiku, Fox 4, in your corner.